Welcome to Electron Line. Now we're going to take a look and see what the transmission of, is of the radiation between about 16 and 14 micrometers. Radiation coming from the surface of the ground at an elevation of 10 meters. How much of it has reached an elevation of 10 meters? We can see that the vast majority between about 15 and a half and 14 and a half and unwinding as we go over here, but the vast majority of that simply doesn't make it all the way up to 10 meters. It is absorbed before it reaches a height of 10 meters or 33 feet above the surface. So again, carbon dioxide is really good at absorbing this radiation here because virtually none of it is transmitted. We can then see that by the time we reach about 16 and 14 micrometers, the transmission is almost 100%. And then we have these two peaks right here. Those are the two harmonics on the next vibrational mode, quantum mode. We can jump one, we can jump two, we can jump three. So each time we jump to an additional vibrational mode, we can see then that, that uh, we have a new peak emerging. The central peak is now completely buried, but we have two new peaks emerging and two more branches a P branch and an R branch associated with those second peaks. They become a little bit more significant now when we reach a height of 10 meters, but still they play a minor role relative to the absorption of this energy right here, and therefore reaching virtually zero transmission. So we're going to continue this. The next time we're going to go up to 100 meters, then a kilometer, then 10 kilometers in the atmosphere to see how carbon dioxide absorbs the radiation from the surface of the Earth. And again, you can see it's fairly effective because at a height of 33 feet, 10 meters, there's already a big band that's almost completely absorbed the transmission down to virtually zero.